Hello, beautiful Libra. Welcome to your weekly reading and thank you for your patience. I hope you had an amazing full moon lunar eclipse, whether you have a sun in Libra, a moon in Libra, or a ascendant rising in Libra. This was a powerful moon for you. So amazing energies. My guides were telling me to wait till Jupiter went direct, which just, it just went direct. So really powerful energies for you for Libra. Um, for Venus energies, for love, for abundance, for creative energies. It's such an amazing, powerful energy within that. And you're probably very much feeling that shift, and I hope it's a positive one for you in whatever aspect it may be in your birth chart. So this week, we're going to be going on to um, the weekly reading. It did take me some time as the energies were still shifting, and I wanted to give it some time. That's a lot of times that happens after full moons and new moons. For me, energetically, my guides will tell me to give it some space, give it some time, and then they'll let me know when it's time to go forward with that energy. So we're going to be doing a goddess reading. It's one card for you, Libra. And then we're going to do a Lenormand card, which is a very straightforward message, which was very symbolic. For you this week. So this week's reading is the 6th of, starting the 6th of April to the 12th of April. So let's get on to the reading and I hope you're doing really, really well. Leave me a comment below how your full moon lunar eclipse experience was anything that was illuminated. I hope it was beautiful. So let's see what goddess wants to come up for you. Beautiful Venusian Libras. You're all Venusian beings. And we need you here on this planet. All right. This is the card that wants to come up. It's about beauty and taking it easy. So ocean. Also about water. Okay. So in, to encourage love, find beauty within yourself, the modest one. So this week's <clears throat> is about being more in your emotional self, expressing your emotional self. And then we have a new moon that's coming in about two weeks time. So allow yourself during this time to really focus on your emotions and express that with your beauty, but in a different way than you have before. It's more of an emotional beauty. Show your emotional beauty to the world. Show that side. I know sometimes it's hard for you because you want to help everyone, you want to please everyone, you want to make sure everyone's balanced, and you want to make sure you're balanced within your emotional, your physical, your spiritual world. Just allow yourself to feel the beauty from within yourself, your soul essence, and share the depth with an oceanic essence that you are as well. So spend some time by water, cleanse, feel the beauty within yourself. Know you are worthy of love. Love is coming to you. Love is here for you right now. So enjoy that beauty essence. Connect to someone beautiful and special through your inner world, your inner beauty. Allow it to shine. That's amazing. That powerful message. And we're going to pull a Lynn Norman card for you and see what the message is about that inner beauty about this week, what wants to be illuminated, what wants to share itself. And we have a beautiful, wise grandmother. This is very interesting, number 29, it's the ace. Ace of spades, very nice, very abundant, very beautiful. A lot about um, very like spur of the moment ideas and they're magnified. This is really much about a woman telling you a message. It could about be an older woman, or it's telling you to speak that wisdom within your wise, wise goddess self. And I'm just going to confirm by looking at my quick notes here for Lenormand. I don't use them as much. And number 29 is his ace, the feminine or someone important who is feminine. So there's an important female in your life this week that's going to appear. This could be a woman, a psychic, I'm feeling as well, especially with a message of that card right here. Going to see a psychic elderly woman, or it could be a wise soul you're connecting with to connect your more of your emotional, your beauty. So maybe that's not something you do every day, but allow yourself to emotionally be wise, emotionally fulfill yourself, emotionally, spiritually, physically meet that inner woman of you and of the other one who wants to show that wisdom. Could be your grandmother. Connect with your grandmother this week, I'm feeling. It's an old wisdom of spiritual essence that wants to come out and shine 
and you're ready for it, Libra. Many blessings your way. Have a beautiful week. If you'd like to get in touch for a reading of your wise woman self, connect with me via email and I will be in touch within 48 hours and we'll get your reading going. So much love your way. Go check out the Facebook page below. I post things every day and I'll speak to you very soon, Libra. Blessings of love and abundance your way.